Good morning students. Today we discuss how to find the solution of one dimensional wave equation. As you all know, the partial differential equation for the vibration of a elastic string, which is known as one dimensional wave equation, is given by dou square y by dou t square is equal to c square into dou square y by dou x square. And let us know, uh, check out the terms comes in the equation. So, suppose that an elastic strung, string is tightly stretched at its both ends, fixed at its both ends AB, which is of length L. Let us take the string along the x axis and let this initial fixed point is at the origin and let this be the y axis. Now this distance x gives the distance of each point on the string from, in, from its initial end. Now suppose that we are stretching the string and releasing it from a point from this point. Your point in the String in a number stretch balich with a board. There will form a vibration, transverse vibration now. That will be in a particular curve. It will be like a curve. Let that be the curve f of x. Now you can see that the distance each point on the elastic string is displaced from its original position or equilibrium position. When it vibrates, vibrating bow e string ile oro point ile displacement on down. Let that displacement be taken along the y axis. Let y be the displacement for each point on the string when it make vibration. So, if y end in a function, I recum, y will be a function of the distance x and the time t. Like in the displacement, we do not distance in him. Other ball than a time in a dependent equal. So y is the displacement at each point of the string when it vibrates, and t is x is the distance and t is the time. And the c is given by t by m, where t is the c square is given by t by m, where t is the tension along the string, and m is mass per unit length. Now let us see how to solve this one dimensional wave equation. We are solving it using method of separation of variables. As you all know using the method of separation of variables we can assume the solution. So since y is a function of x and t let us assume that the solution y is equal to x of x into t of t. The solution is x in a y dm, x in a t dm function i t dk. And simply we will write the solution y is equal to x into t. Where x is a function of x alone, t is a function of t alone. Now by the method of separation of variables, we will find the term by term that is dou y by dou t. That is differentiating with respect to t, it is x t dash. Then dou square y by dou t square. Again differentiating with respect to t, x t double dash. Now dou y by dou x differentiating with respect to e x. We have x dash t and dou square y by dou x square is again differentiating x double dash t. Now substituting these values in the given equation in one dimensional wave equation. Let this be equation 1. Substituting in equation 1. We will get dou square y by dou t square that is x t double dash is equal to c square into x double dash t. Now we will separate the variable like this. We will take x terms along, x along one side and t along the other side. So that we have x double dash divided by x is equal to. 1 by c square into t double dash divided by t. Now you can see that this is a term which includes only functions of x alone 
and this includes functions of t l. In random, it x in a matra function, it y t in a matra function of you. x and t are independent of the chain order. This will be possible only if it will be equal to a constant. In random, it shows up or a constant in equal i and gil matra may it is possible. Avulu. So, we will take that ratios is equal to k. Now, we are going to solve this for capital X and capital T. This solution can be given x and t. And we need to, if you consider this relation x dash divided by x is equal to k, which implies x double dash minus kx equal to 0. And then we will the equation I did come, equation 2. Similarly, second term constraint boon, 1 by c square into t double dash divided by t is equal to k yana. that is t double dash minus c square k t equal to 0 let that be equation 3 now we have the equation in the equation in x equation in the t find out yana. before that solving this we have assumed that this is equal to k which is a constant e constant in the moon value that means the constant k can take either 0 value or k will be a positive value or k will be a negative value. So, we will consider 1 by 1. We will consider case 1 when k is equal to, is equal to 0. The constant is 0 output. Let us see what will be the solution of the equation. So, when k is equal to 0, the equation 2 gives you x double dash minus kx is equal to 0 gives you x double dash k will be equal to 0. So, you will get x double dash equal to 0. And as you know that this is an ordinary differential equation. x is a matra function. It is an ordinary differential equation. That is why we have an ordinary differential equation solution method use method. That is, we can replace this x double dash by b square x equal to 0. So, whose solution is obtained by considering auxiliary equation. What is auxiliary equation of this? Auxiliary equation is m square equal to 0, which gives m equal to 0, 0. It is repeating twice. If the roots are real and equal, the solution is written as c1 e raised to m1, c1 plus repeating roots on angle c1 plus c2 x into e raised to mx and on number solution is done. Now, if the roots are 0 and equal roots are So, our solution is written as capital X is equal to c1 plus c2 x into e raised to 0 x. So, e raised to 0 x is 1 and 1 is done. Capital X is equal to C1 plus C2X and then for the net, when K equal to 0, you can solve this equation also. Solve for T. T Q and solve here. So, T double dash minus C square K T equal to 0. When K equal to 0, you will get T double dash is equal to 0. Similarly, we will get T double dash equal to 0. That is ordinary differential equation. Aana. Function involves T only. So, you have d t d square t equal to 0 whose auxiliary equation is again m square equal to 0 and m is equal to 0 0. We have the variable t analog small t and variable our number solution again and either another either polar than another c1 plus c2 t e raised to m t n r t and number variable instead of x upper c1 c2 already be which one then cut it into constants it come c3 plus c4 t into e raised to 0 t e raised to 0 t 1 on so you get the solution as c3 plus c4 t now we have the total solution y is equal to x into t that is c1 plus c2 x into c3 plus c4 t on case 1 nila nam solution at the obtain chain now we move over to Next case, case 2. That means we will consider k is positive. k positive in the child, we will consider let k is equal to some p square. P square is always positive, whatever value is of p. So, that is p not equal to 0. 
k equal to p square edukka. So, k is positive in the second case consider here. So, it is number equation, second equation, x double dash minus k x equal to 0. Ok, k p square would go, it will become x double dash minus p square x equal to 0, which implies p square x minus p square x equal to 0. That implies d square minus p square x equal to 0. Here, this is also an ordinary differential equation whose auxiliary equation is given by m square minus p square equal to 0. So, that m is equal to p square and uh, m square is equal to p square. So, m is equal to plus or minus p. So, you have to recall the solution when the roots are real and distinct. And the roots are real and distinct roots. Now, we have equation the solution if m1 and m2 are roots, c1 e raised to m1x plus c2 e raised to m2x is the solution. So, similarly, here we can write the solution x is given by c1 e raised to m1 first root is p. So, px plus c2 e raised to next root is minus px. So, this is c1 e raised to px plus c2 e raised to minus px is the solution. Now, Similarly, x in a solve either the d t kim solve. Either number equation 3, t double dash minus e square kt equal to 0. Our k p square armbull, this becomes t double dash minus c square p square t equal to 0, which implies t double dash normal d square t minus c square p square t equal to 0, which is now d square minus c square p square t equal to 0. This is also ordinary differential equation whose auxiliary equation is given by m square. Auxiliary equation can be written as m square minus c square p square equal to 0 which implies m square is equal to c square p square. Hence m is equal to plus or minus c p. As we have got two roots here, Cp and minus Cp, the form of writing the solution is, it is all done. C1 e raised to m1x plus C2 e raised to m2x, whatever uh, variable t yana, roots are Cp minus Cp. Now, we will see the C1, C2 and C3. Yana. C3 e raised to m1, root Cp, t and another variable, t and variable, plus C4 E minus C P T. So this is how we get the solution when K is positive or P square. Our case 2 will have final solution in the final solution y is equal to x into t. X is C1 e raised to Px plus C2 e raised to minus Px into T is C3 e raised to CPT plus C4 e raised to minus CPT. So, this is case 2 we have the solution to obtain. Case 3. Now, case 3. Case 3 is K negative 1. Negative 1 is let us take A is equal to minus P square. Because P square is positive. Minus p square is always negative. That is why k is minus p square. In equation 2 solve yam, x double dash minus k x equal to 0 in the rainbow. But k minus p square is x double dash minus minus p square in the p square x equal to 0. This will become d square plus p square x equal to 0. So auxiliary equation is given by m square plus p square equal to 0 or m square equal to minus p square that implies m is equal to minus p square in the root plus or minus i p n and value. That is the root sum alpha plus or minus i beta formula. You have to recall the solution of ordinary differential equation. Alpha plus or minus beta. That is complex root. Imaginary root. Do you remember how we write the solution? e raised to alpha x into c1 cos beta x 
plus c2 sin beta x n आणु नम्मल सुलूशन एड़ुनुदु इवड़ alpha एड़ प्लेस ले 0 आणु beta एड़ प्लेस ले p आणु अधु उन्ट इवड़ते सुलूशन नमक्क एंगने गिट्टा the solution x is equal to e raised to alpha एड़ प्लेस ले 0 आणु e raised to 0 x 1 आणु e raised to 0 x into c1 cos beta x beta एड़ प्लेस ले p आणु cos beta x cos p x plus c2 sin px p raised to 0 x 1 i don't know let us write this as c1 cos px such as x is equal to c1 cos px plus c2 sin px k negative out similarly e equation third equation t double dash minus c square k t equal to 0 k minus p square on both this equation will become t double dash minus minus p square on both for c square p square t equal to 0 which implies d square plus c square p square t equal to zero, which auxiliary equation of which is given by m square plus c square p square zero in the middle. अब ये बोला है m square is equal to minus c square p square, so that m is equal to plus or minus i c p in the middle. ये बोला है इन the roots are imaginary roots. So the solution for capital T is written as e raised to alpha t. Alpha zero I do under e raised to zero t into c one cos beta x pole. Then c one c two I need to c three cos beta x. Beta is then the c p I do under c three cos c p t I need to be table. Then c four sine c p t. So you guys, you know, ordinary differential equation solve it. Or complete integral. I do na. Part recall ये ना, then we have the solution t is equal to c3 cos cpt plus c4 sin cpt, so that case three ला नमक इन दानो final solution आयत किटिया था, y is equal to x t, where x is equal to c1 cos px plus c2 sin px into c3 cos cpt plus c4 sin cpt idana namde solution when k is a negative value so solving all these two equations for all the three cases case 1 when k equal to 0 when k is positive and k is negative we have got three different solutions alle namaku moonu reethiyulla solution aanu kittiyathu But all these solutions are simultaneously the solution for the equation. इधर ले ये देंगे लो मोर नम आयरिक हम नम का required solution. अब इधर ले ये था ना नम डे one dimension wave equation solution है ना रहिया. You just check out the physical nature of the problem. ये problem तेरे physical nature ने सर्च. अत ये द नम का इवेड स्ट्रक्चर इधर release ही बोल vibrations आनु डालो. Vibrations will be like a wave motion से बोले periodic motion से बोले आनु डालो. That means That physical nature is a physical nature answer is a problem till नम कुछ periodic nature आना वड़ा कान में द अद नम कुछ वेरन द ये मून आमते solution है अद ऐ द case three is cosine sine function वेरन है वड़ा ताना नम का wave motion डे nature वाइट तो पूरे तो पढ़ने वाली solution की टन्ना द अद उन डायमें these three equations our solution for the One dimensional equation do square u by do t square is equal to c square into do square u y by do square y by do t square is equal to c square into do square y by do x square. The solution is given by y is equal to c one cos p x plus c two sine p x into c three cos c p t plus c four sine c p t. So this is the solution of one dimensional wave equation okay thank you